Done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. like we've arrived. This is the way to the medical facility, right? You'll see. Let's keep going. an underground lake here. Tell me, where is the medical facility? It's not here. In fact, it never even existed in the first place. Uh, but I've seen people carried in here with my own eyes. Where could they have all gone? The answer is right in front of you. You need but open your eyes. What do you mean? Are you trying to say that they all drowned in this lake? No. They're just what you see before you. What's left when matter ceases to be matter. Perhaps the scale is throwing you off. Let me show you what I'm getting at. What? No way. So then, this entire lake is... Yes, all this is the Hollowing. I still don't follow, Nagal. What happened to your hand? And what is this Hollowing you speak of? This is what I wanted to show you, my lord. When a life form's drained of its astral energy, its physical form breaks down completely, a death leaving no physical remains. All that's left is a reflective substance, the only proof that matter once existed at all. That hollowing is the substance that fills this lake. This whole lake... How many people? How many Danans? <laughs> you actually expect me to believe all that? 
that an astral arts illiterate Danon would know of this unseen atrocity? And that I, a Renan Lord, would have no knowledge? I have one last piece of evidence, Lord Doalim. This is a fruit of Helgen, the cause of all of this. What are you doing, Miguel? Here is your proof, my lord. Proof of the bounds of your knowledge. Proof of the countless Dan and deaths under your watch. No, they were not merely deaths. Those Danans were completely erased. And now, the only testament is that lake of hollowing. <laughs> Miguel! Someone close to you is behind all of this. This person is amassing huge amounts of astral energy. You have to stop them. You're the only one who can prevent Menencia from returning to the living hell that it was once before. I beg you, for the future of the utopia you have created, please stop them. Don't let your dream die just as it's become a reality. Wait a minute, I... I don't know if I... Miguel! 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 Forgive me, Kisara. I'm sorry. It was the only way I could open his eyes. I didn't have much time left anyway. Please, help our Lord Dohalim to make our greatest dream a reality. Oh, 
All right? What was that just now? I understand this is a lot for you to take in, but Miguel trusted you. Impossible. I have no such power. <sighs> Truth be told, I never wanted this. I never wanted to be a lord. However, competing for a position in the crown contest was required of me, and in the process, I took the life of a dear friend. The life I took and the bloodshed, the hatred that it earned me. It was far more than I could ever bear. But the screams and tears of the slaves, they would reawaken my memories of that day. The memories of my friend's scream and the tears of the one who mourned him. I couldn't take it any longer. I didn't want to remember. So that's it? That's the real reason you freed the Danans? Just so you wouldn't have to listen to their screams? Wait. So everything you've done... Precisely. It was simply to distance myself from all the pain and death. All for my own selfish ends. And if it made everyone happy in the process, well, then that was just an added benefit. Or perhaps I... I truly did believe in those ideals at one point. But living up to them was never my aim. Impossible. Your dream of coexistence? The ideals that you always championed? So you're saying that everything you stood for? You're saying it was all just a self-obsessed lie? <laughs> Tell me it isn't true, Lord Dohalim. Because... Because my brother... My brother believed in you in your dream! Forgive me. So this... This is who you really are? Stop! Let go! Let me go! 
me go! Let me go! It's enough, Kisara! Let go! Stop! I'll tear him apart! I swear I'll... I'll... Are you trying to ignore your brother's dying wish? He entrusted you with his dream! Just kill me. I'm nothing. I am but a shell of a man now. I'm just a pitiful coward who shrank from his duties. I would only ask that you make it quick. This man... This is the person my brother died for. And for what? For what? Change my mind. Are you feeling any better? Yeah, a little. Thanks. What are we gonna do now? I still have unfinished business with Dohalim. He's a world away from the Lord Balsef was. There's no need for us to fight him, Xion. In case you've forgotten, I Guys, don't... guys! I think something's going on outside. There you are! What's happening? Kelzalik has started an insurrection. He's driving all of the Danans out of the palace. What? Has he lost his mind? What about Lord Dohalim? We don't know where he is, Captain. We thought... We thought maybe you would. No, I don't. I haven't seen him since we were inside the quarry. Damn. Well, either way, I wouldn't go near the palace. Any suspected Renan sympathizers are being arrested on sight. This whole thing is a powder keg about to explode. Best prepare for the worst. I guess not all of the Renans here like the idea of coexisting with the Danans after all. So this is it. This is the real Menencia. Are you giving up? On what? This realm is already finished. It perished along with my brother's dream. That's a shame. And I guess all the people who believed in that dream are on their own out there, aren't they? Not all of the Renan sided with Kelzalik. There's still hope, Kisara. Your brother's dream is only dead when there's nobody left who believes in it. Am I wrong? You're right. I'm going to the palace. I need to see what's happening there with my own eyes. Uh, what are you all doing? I thought it was pretty clear. We're coming with you. I appreciate the thought, really. But there's no need for you all to get involved in this. 
Tohalim said it himself, right? All of us, we're liberators. Thank you. Will things be okay in the city? I'm concerned about that as well. But for now, let us get to the palace. Right. We best clamp down on things at the source before they get out of control. The fact the enemy's holding themselves up tells me they're not exactly happy to see us. Then we'd better go in prepared for whatever welcome we get. We have to stop Sir Kelzalik. Don't you think it's about time you drop the Sir? <sighs> he always treated us Danans with such warmth and kindness. Did he have such bad intentions all along? I... I just can't bring myself to believe it. Forget about intentions. We should assume he's the one who's behind all these incidents. It's not surprising to me that there are Renans and men in Sia who resent Dohalim. But I didn't expect one would be so close to him. <laughs> yes, I suppose you're right. I guess all of us here in Menencia are still some way off from being a truly united realm, aren't we? Are you going to be okay, Kisara? I don't know, but I definitely don't want things to end like this. Please, lend me your strength. Of course. Anyone who tries to oppress others is our enemy, and we'll gladly stand against them. Besides, I want to believe that this realm really can do better too. Just as good. Have you guys checked your equipment lately?
can see fighting throughout the city, but it's dead quiet. Either Dohalim's allies have been arrested, or they're keeping a low profile. Meaning the rebels are occupying the palace? Then let's hurry up and kick those bastards out. This place is awfully quiet for a siege palace. Such a huge place is spooky without all those people here. They're probably waiting to ambush us. With so few Renans here, I guess this is what it's like when the Danans are expelled and the ruling minority are all that's left. My money's on them using Zoogles to even the odds. I don't even see any Danan guardsmen. The fact that they're not at their stations tells me they really have been driven out. We all swore an oath of loyalty to Lord Dohalim. My fellow guards wouldn't abandon their post lightly. Speaking of which, where the heck is he? How could this be happening? Any idea where we should go in the main building? Let's try the Lord's Chamber. Worth a shot. wall open, can't you? Well, let's give it a try and find out! You sure about that? From what I hear, that thing can stop even a cannonball. On second thought, let's see if there's a release mechanism somewhere. Are you just going to keep standing around or what? Sorry, I'm just getting prepped over here. Kisara, do you have any idea just what Kelzalik might be planning at the palace? It's hard to say. I've never seen him use any powerful arts. And I don't think he's particularly skilled with any weapons, either. However, I have noticed him accompanied by something strange from time to time. What kind of strange? I don't know. I couldn't see anything with him, but I could sense something was there. Probably some sort of Zoogle. An invisible Zoogle? We'd better be careful in any case. I'd rather we not find out after it jumps us and tries to rip our throats out.
Too big for its own good. Tell me about it. Plus, where the hell were these soldiers and Zoogles all this time? Normally, the Zoogles are kept in specialized training facilities and only get let out in cases of emergency. Like this one, for instance? Give me a break. An opponent like this should be easy. Take down your defenses! Okay, cool. I'll smash you! What a deal! Dance to the way up! Where do the enemy go? Astral energy! Say no more! That is one sword right now! Crossblade! I know fine weapon material when I see it.
opponent like this should be easy. Now you'll you learn. Get the wrong fight. Where are you going? Sword Alpha. In here. Anything I won't show you any mercy. Sword Alpha. Now. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. Don't get complacent. Right, here you go! Engaging! Torrain Alpha! Excellent! Relief! And the storm! Here's the evil! I'll be saving this one! Free blazer! You're a great force! Here's the force! I'm only getting a little bit of a force! Eat this! Eat this! Eat this! Take it down! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Vanquish darkness! Mole Alpha! Sword Rain Alpha! I Looks like we got them all. What could this be? Around here. 
Behind you, Shion. It's on. Now you'll learn. It's on. Water. They really don't give up. You You got to hear it. Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Cyclone! Any injuries? Is that some kind of note the Rebels left? Hey, it mentions the release mechanism we're looking for, but... This isn't enough to go on. Scratches on my shield or my armor. Right, here goes! Oh, my my lord. Lord. won't save you! Oh, here I my shield! Sword rain out! It's it's out. Ignite! Here I come! 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 
shut him down. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Who's in a bright and shiny mood?
Hey, what do you say we fight that shining enemy? Radar. Until I'm the best I can be. Still striving to be on par with the Lord? You simply can't be too strong when battle is a part of your every day. Thank you. 
I think this is a key to the noble room of the castle. A uh, noble what? The room at the northern end of this floor. Maybe the release mechanism is in there. Right behind you, Shion. on my shield or my armor. I'm not done! Get 
to me. Say we fight that shine. We're in for a long slog with this one. forces here too they must be predicting our movements and deploying accordingly so they figured we were coming all along is that it
Take this! You got now you see what I can do! Sword right on the shot! Annihilation! We can die! Life in the universe! From me! Stir up! We can now! Eat dirt! Fear the fear! Astral energy! Say no more! My turn! Sword Rain Alpha! That can't be the law! It's the wall where that came from! Do it! Kisara! Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Strangler! Looks like we got them all. Shut him down. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. the rebels if we combine it with the note we found before then there should be a key inside a cabinet in the office great let's see if we can find it on the prize. Even if Danons and Renans aren't on completely equal footing here, both sides still cared about each other, and now we have to fight some of those same Renans inside the palace. Don't forget, we're here fighting to keep what makes this realm so special alive. Don't lose hope, he's... Sword Rain Alpha! Azure Storm! Time to let it rip! Sword Rain Alpha! Azure 
Did that finally get rid of the wall? To think they would hide it in Lord Dohalim's personal quarters. The nerve of these people. They won't get away with it for much longer. That's right. We have to hurry to the Lord's chamber. Let's go. Well, well, if it isn't the slaves and the traitor, I don't remember giving you permission to enter the palace. So it's true. You really are the one behind all this, Kelzalik. I don't remember giving you permission to speak, either. Know your place, slave. Now we see his true colors. Yeah. A despicable excuse for a human being. Though really, I guess that makes him pretty ordinary, huh? Kelzalik, you were Lord Dohalim's most trusted advisor. His closest ally. Why would you betray him? Don't be a fool. I didn't serve him because I wanted to. I expect a mere slave would know, but there are many powerful contenders for the position of Lord. A contest of strength determines the one who will be Lord and undisputed ruler of a realm. There is no choice in the selection. If my master had any ambitions of becoming the Sovereign, I would have gladly served him. But he had no intention of fighting for the crown. Indeed. Can you slaves even imagine how that looked to the rest of us? Enduring the whims of an ambitionless lord, all we could do was wait for the end as we suffered through our humiliation. You want suffering? Try being Danon for a day. So you plotted against Lord Dohalim in secret. And when my brother found out... And I would do it all again if it meant returning Menancia to its rightful state! A realm where Danons are slaves and Renans their masters! It's the natural order! It's... Enough! Who are you to decide what is natural or rightful, traitor? Miguel. My brother. He dreamed of building a world free of suffering. He gave his life for that dream. And all you've managed to build is a lake of death. You. You killed my brother. And now you'll die for it! Oh, you're so bad. You should sit this one out then. And this all. 
fun. Get no way. Your armor won't save you. Head down. You're all good. Here goes. I'll bring you back from death's abyss. Don't oh, resuscitate me, Gorgeta. I owe you one. Arrow squad! Healing circle! I can only rely on the one. Here, let's go. Thunder storm! Thunder field! You're in the wind! It's over! Air thrust! Don't let out the pistol! Don't let You picked the wrong time! Water, hear my call!
Slaves are despicable. Your dreams of attaining lordship are no more. Give up, Kelzalik. Attaining lordship? <laughs> Ridiculous. Only those who possess a master core can become a lord. <laughs> what did you think just anyone could do it? But then, what were you trying to accomplish with this? Didn't you betray your lord? Yes, that's true. However, there are other lords. Other lords? So you mean... At last, the truth is revealed. Doholi, where have you been this whole time? Cleaning up. Kelzalik, you've made your last of these. The fruit of Helgen? It can't be. You found my production facility? Correct. And I tore it down. But something still troubles me. It's clear that this is no ordinary fruit. Nor was the equipment used to grow it. You couldn't have done all this without outside assistance. Indeed. Something like this must have come from another realm. Sar, perhaps? You actually expect me to talk now? At this point, the contest for the crown will be over soon enough. And you will finally receive the punishment you deserve for your weakness. I've already received my punishment. <laughs> May this be my final act, as the Lord of Elder Men and Sia. <laughs> Go to Mahaksar, Ganeth Horrors, wherever you think you'll find a suitable lord. <laughs> Are you all right with this? He killed your brother after all. He did. But then I thought, he's nothing more than one common, ordinary Renan. He's not worthy of my time or my anger, right? <sighs> So after everything, was the dream of coexisting just a dream? What is that? Those are the cheers of the brave Danans who overpowered Kelzalik's forces. Wait, they challenged the Renans? Indeed. A militia made up of Danan guardsmen, Renan supporters, and of course, the Gold Dust Cats. Do we have you to thank for bringing them all together? Regardless of what your original motivations were, your dream of coexistence saved countless lives. And now, those people out there are fighting to keep that dream alive. That's something real. Be that as it may, they do so now by their own hands. These people no longer need any lord. Where are you going? To put an end to the crown contest. So long as its madness persists, peace will remain ever out of reach. I cannot allow it to continue. The crown contest impacts far more than just the Danans. You're choosing to fight Lenegas and the entire Empire. I am well aware. However, 
if I wish to keep this dream from dying, then I have little choice in the matter. Besides, it's the least I can do. So, you're gonna go out there and make that dream real on your own? You may be decided on your path, but that doesn't make it any less difficult. Why not walk that road with us? Pardon? You heard me. We're fighting to liberate the Danans. You're fighting for the people of this realm. I'd say we're on the same path, really. It would only make sense for us to walk it together. Danon dissidents, side by side with a Renan lord? Not the least intriguing invitation I've received. An invitation which would only be proper courtesy for me to accept. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Hey, where'd Kisara go? I don't see her anywhere. Maybe she just needed some time alone. A lot's happened. That makes sense. She did just lose her brother after all. <sighs> we ought to keep moving as well. So long as there are lords who draw breath, we have a mission to complete. Kisara's a big girl. I'm sure she can handle herself. We should hurry on ahead to our next destination. I guess you're right. And it is a lot safer here than it was. What do you think, Dohalim? I am not sure I have the right to say anything as far as Kisara is concerned. Fair enough. Well, I, for one, would like to say goodbye if we get a chance. Let's keep an eye out for her as we leave. What's Kisara going to do now? I'm sure it's complicated for her. Where did Kisara run off to? You don't think she took off after Kelzalik, do you? No. Nagal entrusted her with his dream. She wouldn't do something reckless like that. Right now, I think she just needs time to think. What she does from here on out is up to her. She has to be the one to decide. Hmm. <laughs>